Hello everyone, welcome back to Math Mode. Here we have interesting exponential equation 2 to the power 3 to the power x equal to 3 to the power 2 to the power x. If you know an answer, if you feel an answer, write a suggestion in a comment and let's try to solve it. Of course, if we have a situation like that, we have so long powers, so long exponent, we of course use our log. So let's try to take log from both of the sides. Let's take natural log. So we will have natural log on the left. 2 to the power 3 to the power x and of course natural log on the right 3 to the power 2 to the power x and if you know if we have situation like that our exponent our power jump right here so our 3 to the power x jump right here and our 2 to the power x you can write it right here using log property so nothing hard just log property so let's write it 3 to the power x times natural log 2 equal to 2 to the power x times natural log 3. Really good simplifying trick. Okay, what we're going to do next? Of course, we can divide both sides by natural log 2 and 2 to the power x. So, because we need x's on the left and our natural log, our values on the right. So, let's divide both sides by 2 to the power x times natural log 2. If we divide in the left by this, natural log 2 and natural log 2 will cancel and as a result we will have 3 to the power x over 2 to the power x. And on the left we cancel 2 to the power x and 2 to the power x and we will have natural log 3 in our nominator and natural log 2 in our denominator. Nothing hard, just a little bit trick right here. Okay, if we have different bases but same exponent, we can write it in one parenthesis. So we will have 3 over 2 to the power x equal to natural log 3 over natural log 2. And really good case, because we just need to take natural log once more and then x jump right here. So we will have natural log, I write it right here, so natural log of 3 over 2 to the power x. And of course, once more, natural log on the right. Natural log 3, natural log 2. Really good case because, as I mentioned it before, x jump right here. We can write it using log property. So we will have x times natural log 3 over 2 equal to natural log of natural log 3 over natural log Nothing car, just step by step tricks, step by step properties, and I think for sure you understand me. I guess. So, what we're going to do next? We just need our x on the left. We don't need our n natural log 3 over 2 on the left as well. So, we divide in both sides by this natural log, and as a result, our x will be equal to natural log of natural log 3 over natural log 2 and all over natural log 3 over 2 from here. Just dividing both sides. Nothing hard on the first side. This exponential equation is real hard because we have power, power and exponent, but using natural log property, dividing, simplifying a little bit and using natural log once more. And this is the answer. The answer is a little bit complicated, but this is how it is. This is our answer. So thank you for watching. If you have any question, if you have any suggestion, put in thumbs up, subscribe for more videos. I really appreciate it. And thank you for watching. See you in the next videos.